we get the win, we move on. But certainly as a coach, there is disappointment with, um, you know, just the fact we didn't put full 60 minutes together. We lost our composure through um, a critical point in the game and, um, you know, allowed them to get back in. Um, I give so much credit to Drexel for the fight they um, they showed today and their comeback and um, it really almost got us. So, you know, but we managed to hang in there and get the job done. The draws was obviously a negative for us. We have some ch had some challenges coming up with answers on, on beating Drexel. They just have um, great players around the circle, around the perimeter. So we struggled there. Um, but, you know, I mean, we had plenty of offensive opportunities. We had some, some great goals today. Um, you know, our scoring was somewhat spread out as it has been. Um, so, you know, there are positives. There are always positives and always negatives you can find. And it's a coach's job to find both of them. It's going to be another day, another game, another opportunity for us to um, continue to get better and, and learn from what we've learned today and um, bring out our best on Sunday because that's what it's going to take to come out on top in the CAA. This is something that we need to learn from and this can make us a better team come Sunday because we're going to be in pressure situations and we've got to be ready to handle the pressure and remain composed and, and be committed to playing hard for 60 minutes and not, not getting comfortable. And I think they just lost that a little bit and um, you know, we've, we just can't, we can't allow that to happen moving forward. So I definitely think they've learned from, from this and it's a good thing that happened today and not, not Sunday when it may have not gone our way.